this is probably the important message for the video. Appreciate your family traditions for as long as they last. to share a few thoughts about our pandemic Thanksgiving. It looks like Thanksgiving will just be Wendy and I at home. We want to do our part to help keep our community and nation safer by not traveling or gathering with family this year. I'm a little conflicted about it. We have throughout this year tried to model good practices on our channel regarding the spread of COVID-19. So we're not actually outlaws, we're just buying a goat during the coronavirus pandemic. <laughs> Just about enough room to stick your head through. Oh, boy. Oh, lightning bug. Also, I, um, you have our, my mother and father in law over. Oh. Um, we're, they're letting us fill the bed right now, kid free. So I'm gonna go in and check on them. But okay. you guys are welcome. Go in, just hang out. If you want, to use the restroom, water. I'll keep kind of coming in and out, type of thing. But I, you know, I want to give you. You guys want some chairs to sit in? No, I'm fine. Okay. I'm fine. You're, you're fine. Yeah. yeah. So Patrick here is a great guy. He's done some plumbing work for us before, and. Um, yeah, I have to run a quick errand, but he's going to go ahead and put this thing together for us, and I'm just going to set it up as a time lapse. My mom has been fighting cancer, and she's doing really great on that front. But she also has osteoporosis, and was just recently hospitalized for emergency gallbladder surgery. She's back now at home recovering from that. Oh my gosh, they're so little. Can I? Mm -hmm. Come here. Mm -hmm. Careful they don't scratch you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, they're so little and sweet. Look. Yeah. Is, that is a cute bunny. Isn't he darling? Okay, this is a special one then. Yeah. So I was wondering, and these are like from purebred rabbits, right? Or whatever you call them. Well, we're Rabbit not sure street. about squirrel, but. Oh, well. Definitely not purebred. Oh. But couldn't you guys sell these um, like to 4 H kids yeah. and stuff? Yeah, I think so. Because don't, don't kill them. <laughs> <laughs> That's their purpose. <laughs> They're yummy. Don't listen. <laughs> I'm just acutely aware of how fragile she is. And I hate to see a Thanksgiving go by without being able to spend a little time with her. You never know how many Thanksgivings we're gonna get. With the recent spike in infections, there are a lot of restrictions going into effect around the country. Here in Oregon, people are limited to gatherings of no more than six people from two households. It does look like these measures are called for, especially to protect our older family, friends, and neighbors. 
My mom's Thanksgiving will be a lot smaller than normal as well, but she will be getting together with her sister. I expect our Thanksgiving meal will be far less elaborate than it normally would have been. But Wendy is by far the best cook in our family. So being quarantined with her is really no sacrifice for me on that front. Our turkey here will at least get a temporary reprieve for Thanksgiving. It's been a few years, but Thanksgiving used to always be a very large family reunion on my dad's side. For quite a while, we'd get together in Tolavana on the Oregon coast. Some families would rent a room in the hotel. Others would just stay in campers. We'd have volleyball contests and of course our annual cribbage tournament. After that, we started renting a Grange Hall out near my dad's. There was a second floor with a stage and people would put on talent shows. A few years, I even brought some of my artwork and set up a little exhibition for everyone in the corner. After John and Helen, my grandparents passed away. Folks started spending more Thanksgivings with the other sides of their families. This is probably the important message for the video. Appreciate your family traditions for as long as they last. Family dynamics are never perfect. They never were perfect. They never will be perfect. But recognize when they are good. Hey, Mom. How you doing? Just thought I'd call and see how you're doing. Yeah, yeah, it's it's uh, working really well. It's going a lot fast, faster than it used to be. I can do a lot more with it. Yeah, well, there's still more to more to learn, but I've got enough that I can make, start doing the videos at least. No, it's a re it's a regular desktop kind of a. Regular desktop. Yep, I think it might be a Dell something. Yeah, it's a Dell. Yeah, yeah, actually I am. So. Oh, awesome. Look at there. Yeah. So for this uh, Thanksgiving video, I'm gonna actually film us or me talking to you on the phone. <laughs> it sounds crazy, but I think it'll be a good ending to the video. Because mostly I'm talking about how Thanksgiving is going to be so different this year. Oh, uh, also, I wanted to mention before I you know put anything out there, it's it's all right to mention that you've had some health scares this year with cancer and and your osteoporosis and everything. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, I love you, mom. All right.